Today I am finally going to be putting away my clothes into my wardrobe. They're sitting in a pile right now and it's driving me insane so I need to sort through all of my clothes and my shoes and put everything into the wardrobe. I'm not purchasing or acquiring any new storage systems for this wardrobe. I am just working with what I've got in this apartment. So it's kind of like a wardrobe organization video but um, essentially I'm just sorting and putting everything away because I did declutter a lot of clothes and things like that before I moved here. So I guess this is just me organizing my wardrobe and showing you what I'm working with and how you can make just a standard uh, robe closet wardrobe look kind of cute, neat, and organized. So this is what we're working with. So this is one side of the wardrobe. I actually really like this organizational system. I don't know where it's from because it just came in the wardrobe, but there's a couple of shelves up the top. I have a spare towel, pillow, blanket, all those sorts of things I'm gonna put in these top shelves and then use these shelves here, I think, for maybe my handbags. I also have four drawers and then a bit of space under the drawers as well. In the middle section, there are two shelves at the top and then a long hanging section, which I can do dresses or coats or anything that is long. And they've also provided me with a bunch of hangers as well. So I've got plenty of room to work with. I know it's looking entirely like chaos, but it's actually very much in order. I just have to hang all of this stuff up onto hangers and then put all of the folded stuff away into the drawers. First thing I've done is I've hung up all of my tops in this end section and then down the bottom I have clipped up some of my pants and my skirts. I definitely have a few more things that need to go in there. I have so many extra coat hangers, way more than I honestly need. And up here in the middle section I just have a few of my dresses, um, a jacket and another little um, blazer as well. Oh my goodness, there's a big... Um, ink stain on this. I've known about that for ages, but I just forgot about it. Um, I don't know why, but I usually have the sleeves rolled up anyway, so you can't see it. But if you're wondering what that is, it's an ink stain, and I don't know what pen or texture it came from. It's really weird to think that that is most of my wardrobe, that there's a few bottoms, a few dresses, and a few tops. I honestly don't own a lot. I still have things that need to go in the drawers, but I've decluttered so much over the years that I've really kind of kept my wardrobe to this very small collection. In the bottom drawer, I have organized it as pajamas, gym clothes, and then loungewear, so like jumpers and track pants and whatnot. In the second bottom drawer, I have all of these long sleeve shirts that I tend to wear under my sweaters when I get really, really cold. I have t-shirts and then a heap of singlets that I wear under my clothes as well because I like to wear lots of layers. In the next drawer up, I have sweaters. I have five in here. There's a couple in the wash and I'm sure I will add to this collection, but it's my sweater drawer. And then in the top drawer, I have under wear bras and socks over in this corner. Now for the best part which is putting all of my bags into these shelves but I'm going to change the height of them so that I can have this one stand up and then some of the smaller ones can fit on the other shelf. I've done the bag side of my wardrobe. It took a little bit of rearranging to get it all sorted, but I have my Dior, my Givenchy, my little Pinko bag, my Louis Vuitton, a couple of clutches up the top, and then some accessories that are up in a Ziploc bag that I'll probably take out of the Ziploc bag because it's not 
particularly very attractive. Honestly, this side of my wardrobe isn't making me as excited or as happy as I thought it would be. I thought it would look way cuter and it kind of doesn't. It looks a little bit boring. You know what would be amazing in here though? If I had two of those three tier bookshelves stacked up right there with all my shoes in them, that would look amazing. But I don't have that, so I think I'm just gonna be putting my shoes on the floor. So I've pretty much done all of my shoes. This is the best that I think I'm going to get in terms of like the organization in here, which I think is fine. It's still neat. If you can't tell, I very much like pointy toed shoes. I think these ones and those boots at the back are the only two that don't have a pointed toe besides my sneakers. So it's just a style that I'm really loving at the moment. So what's left are my packing cubes. These are all from Amazon. I will leave a link in the description. I use these for when I'm traveling because it's just a really great way to organize and Tetris everything into your suitcase. But I'm gonna go and put these into my suitcases because I don't need them anymore. I decided to take out some of the excess coat hangers because there is a lot and I'm going to put these in the storage cupboard that's out in the hallway and then if I do purchase anything and I need more then I can always just go and grab them but I think it just makes the wardrobe look a little bit neater without having all of these in there as well. We're pretty much done. So I have all of my shoes in the center part. I have pants and skirts on this side. In the center hanging part I have dresses and jackets and up the top I have tops and long sleeve shirts like singlets, all that sort of thing. And up the very, very top, I just have some extra linen and towels. And then on this side, I have shoes also down the bottom, all of my drawers, my handbags up in the shelves, and then some more scarves and dresses and things in that centerpiece. The wardrobe is done and sorted. And my final thoughts are, it feels amazing to have it all put away and organized. I feel like I have finally settled in now, which is great. Um, it's not as glamorous as I was hoping it would look, but then again, as I said, I'm not going out to purchase anything to help with this organization system. I'm just working with what I've got, and I think it looks really great, neat, and organized for what I've done. So I hope you guys have enjoyed me putting everything into my wardrobe, organizing, and doing a little bit of styling in the best way that I can. And up the top here, you can check out my last video down the bottom. I will leave a link to another one of my videos, and I'll see you in the next one.